Another major announcement. <clears throat> if you see me moving with my mouth, <laughs> I was just eating some raisin bran. So forgive me. I told this to Sid, and he's going to be putting it out, I guess, today. For the first time ever, I am inviting painters and dancers and artists of any stripe to join the chorus. For example, I can work with an author, a dancer, or a painter using the technology that we use the same way I work with a musician who is not aware that they're holding themselves back. And I'm using a saxophone this time. Excuse me. Holding themselves back and releasing that and it suddenly occurred to me, because I was asked to do this in Mexico, and I'm going to have to do it next year. When they asked me, what do you need? I found myself saying, we need instruments, we need a sound system, but we also need a place for dancers to move. And we need several easels and canvases. Because it doesn't matter what the instrument is. It doesn't even matter what the art is. There's allowing it to be done through the medium of your body. No body, no sound. No body, no paint. No body, no dance. The question is how free is your body to make sound, paint, dance, sing. I want vocalists to know that they are especially welcome and that the steps of effortless mastery will be especially freeing. Because I know the particular problems of putting your out, yourself out there as a singer which is much more intimate and delicate than hiding behind an instrument. But I want to make this official. The course will work for, and it's available to, dancers, singers, which hopefully they know that anyway because they are musicians, painters, and I believe even authors. We can give the assignments that will allow the author to remove the same restriction in what they call writer's block. I'll also composers, really, because it's the same principle, right? We will do the same exercises that remove writer's block, that removes uh, player's block, dancer's block, painter's block. The only block is expectations. And in any manner of judging yourself, based on how well you commit this art, it would be great if that worked, but it actually, almost universally, is the thing that gets in the way of most people when they try to avail themselves of this great gift. So there's the announcement. The course is open to painters, dancers, vocalists, just to know it's not just instrumentalists, Authors, composers, everybody can have this. So there's your announcement. Thank you so much.